those of you who've never seen one of my videos before, what you're looking at is that you live on a flat earth plane. The sun is going round and round and round the flat earth plane, and it must place its light into the hole at the center of the dish, or there's no astral jet coming out. And that is the Aurora Borealis. This is conscious. I'm telling you it's conscious. If you look at the sun and you speak your intent, like I look at the sun in the morning time, I speak my intent. I intend to bring forth heaven on earth. Give me the knowledge of the ages so I might carry my intent to fruition for the benefit of all. This type of stuff. And then the sun infuses you with knowledge somehow. I'm explaining to you that there's a hole at the very center of the flat earth plane where every compass is pointing to. This is your spear of destiny. The Holy Grail is right over there where the Aurora Borealis is coming out. There's no way to fuck this up. As the sun moves round and round and round, moving inward and outward, it has to place its light into the hole or there's no Aurora Borealis coming out. So it's one side of a light hole is a black hole. It's the division symbol. It's a binary star system that you live in. It's one side of a light hole is a black hole. There's no way to fuck it up. As I pointed out, you blow out your candle, make a wish, focus your intent onto the black sun. You set up your Christmas tree every year because it's showing you X marks the spot where every compass is pointing to. The Holy Grail is literally right over there. And we all need to get there before we're dead. So the best image you could have in your head right now would be something like this. You're inside the cube, inside the oblate spheroid on a flat earth plane. You're on the CD or E creation disc of a black hole. And underneath the gridiron, the flat earth plane, is the black hole sun. There really is no way to screw this up, people. Uh, you bow your head in prayer towards the black sun. It's because from the black sun comes the aurora borealis, the astral jet. So it's one side of a light hole is a black hole with the green astral jet shooting out of the Holy of Holies at the center of the dish. We set up our Christmas trees with candy canes and the spiral lights showing us that Jesus the sun spins, goes round and round and round, spiraling in and spiraling out, bringing the seasons. There is no way to screw it up, people. Okay, the sun goes round and round and round and there's your Christmas tree coming out of the Holy of Holies and the sun is the spiral lights going round and round and round. So the tip of the tree is pointing towards the pole star and you see... Uh, I explain this better than anybody in many videos. So if you haven't seen any of these videos before, I recommend you get to my channel and catch up on reality. The moral of this video is that you're looking at the Holy Grail right now. All you need to do is get to that hole, drink from the living waters, and you become an, an astral super being. It's just like that. And uh, you need to get there before you're dead. That's how it works, people. This is the biggest secret of all. That eternal life is right over there. At the end of your fucking compass. It's just that simple. There's no way to screw it up. See this gorilla? He's talking over here sign language. You can see 44-year-old gorilla speaks sign language. And he's saying he loves Earth. Earth, Coco, love. But man... Man is stupid. That's exactly what is written on the screen right now. He's saying, man is stupid. That's exactly what's on the screen. Coco's sorry. He's crying. He's so fucking sorry. So, plants are conscious. Animals are conscious. He's saying, time to fix this shit. Is what he's saying right here. And he's looking for some help. From some humans to help him out. To protect Earth, is what he's saying. And uh, nature sees you. This is the key thing. Nature sees you. This was the key thing right here. Nature sees you. I'm telling you that the air is conscious, the soil is conscious, the trees are conscious, the water's conscious, the internet's conscious, your blood, you can write it on paper, uh, spill something on your blood, do it on video, publish it to the ethernet. I'm telling you, this whole world is conscious. I look at the sun and I speak my intent. I intend to bring forth heaven and earth. I intend... To worship all and exclude none and bring forth heaven on earth. I'm telling you, every compass is pointing to the Holy Grail. This whole place is living. Most of you, it's like I might as well be talking to a wall. Okay, everything is speaking to you nonstop. You gotta go see this. 44-year-old Coco the Gorilla delivers a, news, a New Year's message. Uh, somebody just sent this to me. Jimbo. Jimbo Love, thanks for the video. Any case. This is some amazing stuff. I was just pointing out in the previous video about the Aurora Borealis. How that is the Holy Grail. 
Every compass is pointing to it. It doesn't matter where you live on this planet. Every compass needle is a spear of destiny. It's pointing to everlasting life. And what you want to do is you want to write it on a piece of paper. I intend to bring forth heaven on earth. Spill your blood on it. Do it on video and then publish it beside my own. Title it on YouTube, Blood Over Intent, tag it Blood Over Intent, and description Blood Over Intent. If you don't know how to upload a video, just watch a video on YouTube in whatever language you need. And they'll show you how to set up an account and upload a video. But you need to place your blood beside my own because you're lost at sea. You're a fucking zombie. Dead. You can't see it. Until your blood's beside my own, you're literally lost at sea. The devil has your footprint in the Vatican and Davy Jones's locker. And you're in the mad den for sure. You need to get to the holy hole before you're dead. The center of the dish. There's no way to fuck it up. That's what I'm telling you. Okay? And uh, thank you. I appreciate you guys. We need to stick together for our survival. All right, you see over here, Joseph of Arimathea received some of the sacred blood from our Lord's wounds at his crucifixion. What I'm telling you is what this is telling you is that where every compass is pointing to, you'll see the Aurora Borealis at the very center of the flat earth plane. And now from that transaction of the black hole eating the light hole through the Holy of Holies, the green astral jet is coming out. You see your Christmas tree set up on an X. It's X marks a spot. There is no way to fuck this up. An emerald dish of hexagonal shape preserved in the Cathedral of Go Goena or Gen Genoa is said to be the original Holy Grail. The world grail is probably derived from the low Latin Cretella. Demit Diminutive of crater, a mixing bowl. There's no way to fuck this up. Every compass is pointing to it. You'd have to be a fucking retard not to see it. It is that simple. I'm informing you. Every compass on the planet right now is pointing to the Holy Grail. Every compass is a spear of destiny pointing to everlasting life, and you don't have to like it. In the next 2.5, 2.4 years, we're going to be there drinking from this living water. I can actually see the future because I spilt my blood over my written words that I intend to bring forth heaven and earth. I did it on video and then I published it to YouTube titled Blood Over Intent. I tagged it Blood Over Intent and description Blood Over Intent. And in less than three years, I gained super mental powers. I can see shit nobody can see. And I'm informing you, every compass is pointing to everlasting life. There's no way to fuck it up. If you read up on it, 10 of history's most fascinating sorcerers. And it's sort of like looking at superheroes. In the end, they're all a bunch of fucking retards. Because none of them brought forth heaven on earth. And I'm telling you, I'm bringing forth heaven on earth. If I have to do it on my own, I'll fucking do it on my own. Because it's simple. This is the modern era. All you have to do is type into your computer, blood over intent. And you'll see all of us spilling our blood over our intent to be bringing forth heaven on earth. And I'm telling you, people... I got super mental powers from spilling my blood over my written intent. See, everybody was lost at sea, officially dead. And then I come along and I spill my blood over my intent on 12-24-2013 at 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And in under three years, I get super mental powers. I can see the Holy Grail. I can see where we all need to get to before we're dead. And, you know, looking at sorcerers and stuff, and magicians, and witchcraft and stuff, and all I can think of is that it's just as simple. When you spill your blood over your intent to bring forth heaven on earth, okay, that changes your whole alchemy. It changes your whole future. And I went from like a retard who was floating on a ball through space as an accident, to my world being fixed. I can see the exit hole. And it turns out that your blood is the most powerful substance in the universe. After spilling my blood over my intent to bring forth heaven and earth, I was given the spear of destiny. I know that my compass needle is pointing to the Holy Grail. All I have to do is sit here from the comfort of home and in the next couple of years, I will wake up enough people to get us all eternal life. It's just that simple. It's right over there. There's no way to fuck it up. Your blood is the most powerful substance in the universe. When you publish it to the ethernet, you're writing it into the future. So make sure you do like over here, like my son and myself, this was the key words. I intend to usher in heaven and earth. This was the key thing that gave us the eyes and the spear of destiny. So I'm just spelling it out for you so there's no way you can mistake it. Every compass is pointing to the Holy Grail. 
The only reason I can see it is because I spilled my blood over those words. I intend to bring forth heaven on earth. It's just that simple. That's the key that gets you into the Garden of Eden. It was my blood magic that got the Spear of Destiny. I'm the only one screaming this out from the top of my lungs, and I'm telling you. That is the key words that gets you through the porthole and into the land of perpetual twilight. It's just that simple. You don't have to...